Hey everyone, Sean here with a Project Pelennor mini update. Today I'll be painting some of the Warriors of the Dead models for the project. Uh, as promised, I do have some time lapses here to show you how, and I found a technique that I really, really like. Uh, basically, I'm using a single contrast paint here to kind of replicate the, the look of them being undead and ethereal. Uh, so what you have to do is you have to base coat your miniature in a very light color, uh, I've chosen to go with Citadel's Grey Sear out of a spray. And all you have to do then is layer um, a thin layer of contrast paint. Uh, in this case, I'm using Griff Charger Grey, which is kind of this bluish kind of almost like aqua teal kind of thing. Um, normally, you have to do a thick coat of this on, uh, on contrast paints, but I find that a thinner coat with these guys really helps to, to let the lighter colors show through and it helps make them look a little more ethereal in the end. So using a larger brush, I spread the, the contrast paint throughout the model, making sure that it doesn't pool too heavily in any, any regions. Uh, you don't want to have a lot of dark blotches in there. You want to kind of have an even coat. Uh, the exception I would say is maybe in their eyes, in the, their, the eye sockets, obviously having them be a little darker and uh, look a little more lifeless uh, kind of helps the, the overall effect of these being uh, Warriors of the Dead. So yeah, um, this really does feel like it's painting on easy mode because like I said, it's quite literally one paint, um, but I'm very happy with the effects. I'm very happy with the results. They look pretty close to what the movie has them looking like and that's what I'm going for in the end. So I hope you enjoyed this. Um, all that's left really for these guys is to actually base them and make them look like they're actually standing on, in the Battle of Pelennor Fields kind of area. And I have some, some basing materials coming in all the way from Australia for that. So hopefully in the next week or so, I'll be able to start doing that. And I'll do a short video on, on how to base. But yeah, aside from that, this has been a mini update for Project Pelennor. Hope you enjoy.